Want to speak more of your target language? Then you'll need to know more words and phrases. Except, the problem is, memorizing word lists is painful and boring. But the good news is, you don't have to memorize for hours. You can glance through our principal visual flashcards and easily master over 1,500 of the most common words. And in this guide, you'll discover how to get free access to visual flashcards, why these flashcards help you acquire words faster than typical word lists or digital flashcards, and how to learn words fast with the flashcards. But first, if you don't yet have access to our language learning system, sign up for a free lifetime account right now. Just click the link in the description to get your free lifetime account. So let's jump in. I'll guide you through our learning system so you get to see exactly what's inside and our members-only study tools. Okay, so what are visual flashcards? Our visual flashcards are printable, illustrated flashcards that teach you the 1,500 most common words across 60 topics. So if you're a member, you already have access. If not, now is your chance to get them for free for a limited time only. We'll close down access soon. So to access these flashcards, sign up for a free account and then go to this page and download these PDFs. So we'll click the download now button and you will find when the download is ready, a big folder of all of the different flashcards that you can use. So open them up and then we'll go to the folder where we can choose our topic. So in this case, I'll open this one about the lake. So when you open up your flashcards, you'll see a bunch of different images, yeah? And if they are upside down when you open up up the file, don't be worried, that's normal and it's okay. So when you open up your flashcards, you'll choose the one that is the most interesting for you and then make sure that you print them out in two-sided or double-sided format so that there's an image on both sides of the paper so that you can flip over the flashcard, right? So once they're all printed out, you can cut them out and then use them to start learning. So make sure you visit the link in the description to get access to all of these right now. Then next, I wanna talk a little bit about how you can use these to learn words fast. But first, I wanna talk about how people learn words. Most popularly, it's probably through cramming and memorization, right? But the best way to learn anything is not actually to cram. Rather, you should review the words for just a few minutes a day, every day. And that daily repetition is what locks the language into your memory and you get used to the words like it's your own native language, right? So that's something that you can do with visual flashcards. You can print them out as physical cards and you can easily go through them a few minutes a day. And also, if it's physical, it's much easier to reach for it and use it than an app that's just kind of somewhere in like the third screen of your iPhone, right? All of these flashcards also include an image for each word. So your brain can easily create a connection between the image and the word. And this helps you to remember it better instead of just relying on text all the time, which is the case with most digital flashcards and word lists. Okay, so after printing and cutting out your flashcards, there are a few different ways that you can use these visual flashcards to study. So one of the ways, of course, that you can do this is just to go through the flashcards and review them for a few minutes a day to refresh your memory. But I also wanna talk a little bit about some different strategies that you can use with these cards so you get different types of practice. So one thing that you can do to get some speaking practice, of course, is to make sure that you read the word out loud. So don't just look at it and read it in your mind, make sure that you read the word out loud so you actually say, in this case, you know, bench and escalator and kiosk as you look at the picture that's on the visual flashcard. So this is one way that you can get some speaking practice. Another thing that you can do to make sure that you understand and you have good recall is to flip the cards over and take a look at just the picture and then try to remember the meaning. Try to recall the meaning and say it out loud. So that means without reading it, and of course, if you forget, you can flip it over to check. But again, you can do this to practice just your recall. So looking just at the picture, uh, I think it's escalator, am I correct? Yes, great, okay. So if you get it wrong, of course, you can put it to the back of the stack and then try again so that you're giving yourself the opportunity to repeat those cards that were challenging for you, yeah? So again, you can just use the card, flip it over, and then get the answer that you need and then put it to the back of the stack. So these are a couple of different ways that you can use the cards to do speaking practice, to get some recall, 
spell practice. And again, these are just ways that you can use the cards alone. You could also use the cards together with your friend, have a friend test you if you want to as well. Another thing that you can do, depending on the card set that you're using, you can actually place these cards on the objects that they represent in your house. So for example, if you have a flashcard that's for something like your computer or for your refrigerator or something like that, you can put the flashcard on the object that it represents so that you always remember to practice that vocabulary word when you use that object or when you see that item. So these are a few different ways that you can make sure that you quickly memorize these words after seeing them a few times times and getting used to practicing with them every day. So if you want to learn the language and get access to these learning tools and our learning system, sign up for a free lifetime account right now. Just click the link in the description to get your free access your free language gifts right now before they expire. First, our brand new visual flashcards. Want to speak more of the language? you'll need to learn more words. And with our new printable visual flashcards, you'll know over 1,500 words. Just download and print them out. Second, the must-know idioms writing worksheet. You'll master the most common idioms by writing them out with this free gift of the month. Download it now for free. Third, how to talk about your phone plan in your target language. You'll learn how to say cell phone, contract, data plan, and more. Fourth, animal sounds vocabulary. Learn how dogs, cats, and cows sound in your target language with this quick one minute lesson. Fifth, the top 50 marine animals and fish. How well do you know animal names in your target language? With this lesson, you'll learn how to say shark, whale, dolphin, and much more. And sixth, Want an app that teaches you the language through conversations? Download Innovative Language Learning for free for the Android, iPhone, and iPad. You'll unlock bite-sized lessons that teach you practical conversations and get you speaking in minutes. To get your gifts and language learning resources, click the link in the description below. Download them right now before they expire. Hey everyone, welcome to the Monthly Review, the monthly show on language learning where you discover new learning strategies, motivational tips, study tools, and resources. By the way, all the lessons and bonuses you're about to see can be downloaded for free on our website. So click the link in the description right now to sign up for your free lifetime account. Okay, today's topic is new topics and talking points, the easiest way to increase your speaking time. If you want to speak your target language better, you'll often hit two specific ceilings that you'll need to get around. The good news is one of them is easy to get around and it involves picking up new talking points. That's why today you'll discover one, the ceilings you'll hit when speaking in your target language and two, But first, if you're looking for new free language resources and downloads, here are this month's new lessons and resources. Be sure to download these now before we take them down in a few days. First, our brand new visual flashcards. Want to speak more of the language? You'll need to learn more words. And with our new printable visual flashcards, you'll know over 1,500 words. Just download and print them out. Second, the must-know idioms writing worksheet. You'll master the most common idioms by writing them out with this free gift of the month. Download it now for free. To get your free resources, click the link in the description below right now. They're yours to keep forever. Now to today's topic. New topics and talking points, the easiest way to increase your speaking time. Part one, ceilings you'll hit when speaking in your target language. When you start speaking in your target language, one of the most common ceilings you'll run into is, is running out of things to say. Has that ever happened to you? But another problem that can happen is you'll get good at some conversations, like talking about yourself or why you're learning the language. But how is that a problem if you get good at it? Well, if you get hit with another topic that you can't talk about, then it's game over. Just imagine you're talking almost fluently about topic A. You're impressing the native speakers and everything is going great. But then topic B comes along and you start struggling. The native speakers will quickly realize your language skills are not quite up there. And even though you're quite good, you're still a beginner. 
it's kind of ironic, right? You can speak almost fluently with one topic, but you freeze up with another. This happens quite often with beginners. So how do you get past this? As a general rule, if you want to extend your speaking time, there are two things you can do. Number one, learn to talk about new topics or talking points. Or two, learn to talk more in depth about what you already know. The second one comes slowly over time as you learn new words and grammar patterns. So if you're actively learning a language, you're always working on the second one. But the short-term easy way to speak more is to have more talking points and be able to talk about new topics. How? Part two, how to apply this learning tactic. If you want to be able to talk about new topics and have more talking points, then that's exactly where our one minute conversation cheat sheets come in. These cheat sheets serve as a primer for new topics and conversations. You'll get brief dialogues for topics like weather, hobbies, and more so that you can use them in conversations. The second way you can build up your list of talking points is to simply write out topics you like, like your hobbies or music or topics you may anticipate in future conversations. Then look for lessons around these topics inside the lesson library. You'll learn conversations that you can then use in real life with native speakers. You can also check out our can-do lessons in the lesson library. These can-do lessons cover specific topics like introducing yourself, talking about yourself, your family, and more. But unlike the cheat sheets, with the lessons, you'll get to hear entire dialogues. You'll hear the native pronunciation, learn how to talk about these topics more in depth, and practice speaking. Again, the goal here is to expose you to new talking points and topics, new conversations, so that you can use them in real life, so that you're not just good at talking about one thing in your target language, and so you can boost your speaking time by a bit. Thank you for watching this episode of Monthly Review. Next time, we'll talk about how to ramp up your language progress for the second half of the year. If you enjoyed these tips, hit the like button, share the video with anyone who's trying to learn a language, and subscribe to our channel. We release new videos every week. And if you're ready to finally learn language the fast, fun, and easy way and start speaking from your very first lesson, get our complete learning program. Sign up for your free lifetime account right now. Click the link in the description. See you next time. Bye. Great work. Here's a reward. Speed up your language learning with our PDF lessons. Get all of our best PDF cheat sheets and ebooks for free. Just click the link in the description.